Hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Link to the Past. Now last time we beat Little Four Thieves Town, and today we're going to do some errands. This might be a very long video, so be prepared for it, because we're going to get a few upgrades today, and that's what we're going to do. But first off, we're going to hurry up and get our sword upgraded, because that's the thing I've been waiting for for a long time. We went to we went through four full dungeons with this master sword, so I think it's time for an upgrade. Oh, never mind. We don't want to go here yet. We want to go down here and talk to this frog right here. All right. So now you grab him. What you want to do is warp back to the light world. And he turns into a little dwarf. You can go through the rest of the game with the Master Sword if you'd like to. It doesn't matter. It's just going to be a big note at the end that you're going to wish you upgraded. But if you want, if you like challenges, go for it. Alright, so now we dropped him off. We want to go out and then go back in. We could temper the sword for 10 rupees. And now we go on without a sword. Okay, so now, after we got our sword tempered, we're waiting for it. What you want to do is go back into the dark world. Because we gotta go back in that same area. Alright, so we're just gonna go back here into the dark world. staircase and that contains a piece of heart down here cool. okay so now we got a piece of heart finally now what you want to do is grab this chest right here okay now whatever you do don't push a like don't push a to dash because it won't it will not keep up with you it, you'll leave it behind hop off the ledge either because it'll be like this. Oh, I guess it hops off the ledge with you. I guess I'm thinking of the other item that follows you later on in the game that you can't hop off ledges. Okay, so you just want to continue make your path all the way down here. Once again, watch out for the enemies. But you should be fine because you got a hammer. It's like ten times more powerful. Okay, 
Okay, so let's get this show started. Alright, so now you're free from this area. Now I'll just go down here. I think you can beat level 6 if you want to right now as well, because level 5 I don't think it matters. But we're gonna go in order. We're gonna go in order, so that's what we're doing. So just go up here. Keep going. Ooh, do they drop parts? Yep, one does. Okay, so let's keep going in this direction over here. Don't worry about him. Don't worry about him as well. He ain't gonna do nothing. Ah, wish we could slash through the signs like the Game Boy Advance version. Alright, just take care of you. I just got hit by that weakling. Okay, so let's head down here. Just defeat these guys. I don't want to beat that much of a big deal. Wow, that one was alive. Okay, that was awkward. Okay, so what you want to do? Oh! Hey! Let's go over here. Now, that's level 5 right there, but we can't get in it, so we'll have to go around it. So, we're going to be teleporting through this thing. How? This is how you do it. Alright, so, first I want to get some berries. Now let's go to level 5. Finally. Okay, so what you want to do is pick up this rock right here. And throw it and voila. You're on the opposite side of level 5. Okay, now welcome to level 5, the ice palace. Now the ice palace is not that hard. Um, it's just lots of ice. Yay, we love all of ice, right? And winter's coming soon, so speaking of it... Why not face it now? Okay, so we're gonna go here, and I get shocked. That's nice. Come on, stop it. Stupid jellyfish. Hey! Oh man, I almost got shocked again. Hey! Ah! Stupid jellyfish. And beware. Be careful of your magic, because there is lots of ice guys and stuff that probably will cause to use a lot of magic, so really the big tip is to use your sword and your hookshot because most of these enemies that you're going to see is these guys all around. They ain't going to be that too much of a big deal. It's just penguins. Angry penguins. Yeah. Go away. I don't like you. Wherever you guys are around. Okay, now we get a compass. Cool. Yeah, I say the same thing every dungeon. Can you say something else? Uh -huh. Okay. Now we defeated those penguins. Now let's go to the store to your far right. Now, we gotta defeat them again. Wow, look at their teeth. Hit the switch. Now I'm gonna warn you, there's nothing to your far out right here. You're just gonna get blocked. Oh, cool. What the heck did I just do? I don't know. Okay, step on the switch again. Now you can make your way to the north. Now, all you have to do is bomb the um, floor. You don't have to defeat the jellyfish if you don't want to. But it might drop magic a little bit of magic, so... Hey, come on now. I'm trying to be friendly here. I'm trying to save the day. Okay, so what you want to do is put the bomb at a certain angle because it will hit twice if you don't put it at the right angle. It'll just cause it to hit it once if you put it at a certain angle. On this floor, go down. And after that, we're going to stop it here. So next time, we're going to finish the rest of level 5, or probably we'll take another part of the video to level 5. So if you guys have questions or comments, just let us know. Let me know, really. And I could I'll try to answer them as soon as possible, and try to answer them. Hope this video helps, and you guys have a good night.